Yeah. Yeah, uh, it was completely useless to tame. To be honest, it, it did nothing. Okay, so Charlie, there's some good news and some bad news. One of us has to stay. Uh, actually, no, I'm lying. Hmm? Oh shit, he actually attacks back, what the fuck? What did you... Oh yeah, he, he'll attack it. He'll attack back, yeah. Well, I killed him. What, did you think a big tortoise isn't going to attack back? Well, it just kind of caught me off guard. Okay, Charlie, I'm going to introduce some new magic to you. I like magic. I did get okay. some keratin. Okay, so hop off your stupid raptor. Hey. Hold get on. Get off the damn... Get off Fine. the lizard. You get off no. the lizard. I'm not on the lizard, stupid. Okay, so. Pick this up. Ooh. Put it in your hand. Where? It doesn't matter where. Just put it in your goddamn hand. No. No, no, no. No, no. Not that. This. Hold it down while you're looking at it. Hold Just it? hold it down. Don't move. Okay, there you go. Now, there's two important things you got to realize. Mm-hmm. You can't keep that thing in there forever, or it will die forever, and you will lose that cryopod I just gave you. Yeah. And also, if you do throw it out, and you cryopod it up again, there's a cooldown before you can uncryopod it. Yeah. So, there's restrictions to what you can do. Can you just pick me up and take me home? Yes, I can, because now we have a very nice beaver that will be very useful for gathering wood, if we can make the saddle. <laughs> I can sense the dread. I can sense it from here. You you got somewhat upset when I said, if we can make the saddle. No, I was more or less wondering if you saw what I just threw out of my inventory as you picked me up. Why are you stopping? It was a bow. It was a bow. It was a bow. It was my old bow. <laughs> Well, you're going to need that bow, because I'm taking that crossbow back. Oh, you bitch. I thought you had an extra crossbow. Well, fuck. No, I don't have an extra crossbow. Oh, well, um, just so you know, we were in the air when I dropped it, so I don't actually know where it landed. Well, you better get to finding it. <laughs> it's all I probably can in the water, in all honesty. <laughs> you're going to have to get to finding it. Get to finding it, Charlie. <laughs> There's wild beavers in here. Yeah, there are wild beavers. Uh, I didn't think about them. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be able to find this. I'll just have to make another one. Okay, fine, but I'm still taking back my crossbow. That's fine, but it's... I used it's... that crossbow in making this base. I know, it's, it's in the... It's either in the water... Or in the forest. Yeah. It... Thanks. That was my face. Stop moving, please. I'm trying Stop to clear moving. the trees. You're making it harder. You're making it harder by moving. How hard is it to just wrap your big meaty claws around my throat and carry me? Because I drop you every time you make contact with the ground or another item. I'm aware of this. How about I have an accident and just drop you in front of the torta the tortagar? Let's not do that. Yeah, let's see how fast you can run, because I guarantee the thing runs faster than your raptor. I mean, I just upgraded my speed again, so... No, I mean seriously, that thing hauls ass. I mean, my speed is 129%. This thing can actually... The tortagar can actually keep pace with the thing I'm flying you over the ocean on. Alright. Question is, can you make it all the way to the Red Obelisk in your current stamina? I endeavor to. 
And if I can't, I will be stopping on one of the nearby beaches before we die. Oh, I thought there was ocean all the way to it now. Nope. Why would there be ocean all the way to it? Because I didn't see the land loaded in yet. Hmm. Yeah, suddenly the man gets a level 209 raptor and all of a sudden he doesn't like the dodos anymore. No, I'm still going to have all my dodos. I just want to eat dodos because I want some meat right now. I'm saving you from a fight you have no hope of winning. Is he scratching or biting? Uh, both. Oh, Charlie, here's those elephants you like so much. True. Oh. See? He's so pretty. How do I, how do I tame one? Uh, same way as we would with any other dinosaur. We have to knock it out. Uh, oh, also here's one of the new fish that are added in by the uh, Atlas Import mod. Fish? Uh, yeah, Some... it's a Chow Praia catfish. Oh. Yeah, it's very pretty. Is it hostile? You may see it glitch the hell out of the water and come flying up in a minute or two. You should be safe to swim in there. There's just a piranha or two if you want. The really yeah. big fish. Yeah, the big one. Yeah, that's a chow pry, a catfish. Charlie, Charlie, don't there he don't is. don't get piranha crazy, okay? I was gonna try and kill it. Charlie, you you aren't good enough for that. You're right, I am not. That would be a great feat if I just happened to sword one to death. Well, not really, no. I sword them to death all the time. I mean, you're just not good enough. Fuck you. Yeah, how about I feed you the Dinosuka since you're so happy about using the F word at me? I'm good. Y you sure? I mean, it's not like you don't use it towards me. What? It's not like you don't use it towards me. Nah, not as much as you do to me. I hardly ever. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you see him now in broad daylight, Charlie? You see him now? You see this big crocodilian? No, I see the titan over there. Yes, I see him. Yeah, okay, okay. I do see the titan too, though. Yeah, I know. You you know, it's funny. Ironically speaking, in the Titanosaurs dossier, mm -hmm. it says that... Um, Usually, you actually see the Titan before you see the land. And this is true. You usually do see the Titan before you see the land around it. Oh, look, hmm. there's that Tortigar just right under the water's surface, eating a shark. Be thankful I killed the Hydra Lizard. I still don't see this damn Tortigar. Like, I, I see all kinds of things, but I can't tell what they are. Exactly. It's because your eyes aren't trained like mine. No, it's because I'm also half blind. Yeah, well... We're back home! So you may want to uncryopod your casteroids. My testoids? And, uh, casteroids, your beaver. By the way, that's your one cryopod. Seeing as how it'll last 29 days in your inventory, I expect us to make a cryo fridge and have electricity before it dies. If we don't, uh, I will be very disappointed in you. So this thing will just disappear in 29 days anyway? Uh, no, in 29 days it turns into a dead, broken husk in your inventory. Unless you put it in the cryo fridge. So, uh, let's see if we can make a saddle for it. Alright. Let's see. What do we need for the casteroids? We need 140 cementing paste, 200 fiber, and 100 metal, and 180 thatch. So that's kind of a daunting thing, but we have the metal. 
The thatch is relatively easy to get hold of. All you gotta do is use the doodicarus and smash a tree or two. Or three. How, how do you spell die? Uh, what do you mean die? Like hair dye. D-Y-E. That's what I thought. Is that not a research thing? Uh, no, that's not a research thing. Do you want to make dyes? Well, I have a paintbrush, so... Well, if you want to make... Uh, if you want to use that paintbrush, you need to learn how to make dyes, and I can t teach you how. Sure. You, yeah, you need to come inside first, because obviously I am not able to teach you out there. Ah... So many fucking dinosaurs. You piece of shit. You hit the door in my face. And okay. the door is damaged so, too. In order to make die, there are a few things you need. These doors are so damaged. Charlie, Ow. look at me. Pay, pay the fuck attention. Okay. So in order to make... That's right, daddy. Be beat me out. Knock me down. I'm taking back your cat. No, not the cat. You, you're going to behave? Or, or would you prefer I drag you to the cliff, throw you <laughs> off, and feed you to the cobra? Please don't. Okay, then. I still have to make my bow, and I still have your crossbow. Oh, right. Let me, so. let me rectify that situation right now. Okay. Now, Charlie. Yes. Okay. So, in order to make dyes, there are a few things that you need. First, okay. what you need is a water skin or a source of water. So, like a water jar, a canteen, uh, yeah. or a water skin, which is made of leather and hide and thatch and yeah. fiber. Um, so, you get a water skin and mm -hmm. you put it in this cooking pot. All right. And for some odd reason, there's a lot of spoiled meat in here. I think it's because I put it in there. Um, yeah, so what you do then is you take charcoal All right, and some of those. berries of different colors and you put them inside the cooking pot. And it needs fuel, obviously, and you need charcoal. So let me see if we have any charcoal. We got lots of charcoal in this fireplace. Okay, then. I'll is the charcoal it. not the fuel? No, the charcoal is not the fuel. You need something like thatch or wood. All right, hold on. Uh, What's it? Nope, not that chest. Let me out of the chest. This chest. Okay, Charlie, come over here, please. Yep. Okay, so look in the inventory. Oh, you put fucking wood in there. Yeah, I did. All right. Now watch. And that's all it can make. You made some brown dye because you put a whole bunch of different berries in with charcoal, and it used up your um, water. Water. Skin. So, if I want a specific color, I really only need that one color. It actually follows color logic. Yes, it follows color logic. But, in order to make different shades of that color, sometimes you add in spark powder, sometimes you add in gunpowder, sometimes you add in, um, let's see, what else can you add in? Maybe a stem berry to the mixture, too. Sometimes a color can only be achieved through mixing of multiple berry types. All right. Yeah. So it's not so easy. And usually die making is a lot easier if you have a pipe system. So what I'm going to go do is I'm going to find the nearest beaver dam and rob it blind. I know where there was one. Yes, but that's all the way across the map, and I don't feel like lugging your carcass all the way over there. Plus, I'm doing this to give you your beaver saddle. So All right. that you won't have to manually collect wood by hand. So, 
So up until then, amuse yourself. Or come up with an interesting co topic of conversation. Well, I just made me a ton of water skins to go and get tons of water. Okay, Charlie, I'm, I'm going to be perfectly honest here. Did you take hide from the smithy? No. Okay, thank God. Because if you did, I was going to have a miniature conniption fit because I was using that hide to make your saddle. Yes, I just took all the hide out of the smithy because I'm an asshole. Well, okay. Um, so. Oh, I had some. I had some. Anything interesting to talk about? Uh, not really. Charlie, I'm talking about anything. Anything all the way from politics to religion. Hmm. You, you can't think of one interesting thing? I don't know. There's a lot of stuff that goes on in my life every single day, so... Well, name something interesting that you saw today. Today? Yeah. Hmm. What all did I even do today? <laughs> Married life, ladies and gentlemen. This is what it does to you. I couldn't remember to begin with. Um. Gosh darn, what did I do today? I went to Cory Hart's. I can't tell you anything about him at all, unfortunately. I really can't. Who the hell is Cory Hart's? Uh, he is a large customer of ours. He you just owns... told me I can't tell you. I can't I, tell you anything about him. I can't tell you certain things. Now, I can tell you the same thing I told everyone else. And that's all I could tell you. Hmm. Interesting. Literally. So, basically, you brought up a random dude that you can't tell us anything about. Well, I I'm kind of just going over what I did today. Um, I washed the van. I cleaned out the van. I got ready for Run my job next... Van. No, I got ready for next week's job. Um, oh, I went to uh, Dog the Bounty Hunter's place here in West Monroe, his um, Bond place. Not not the Dog Bounty Hunter on TV, or I don't believe he is. I could be wrong, though. Um, I mean, that guy is from Louisiana. I know that. Um, I, I don't know. He goes by a dog, and he is a bounty hunter. And he, he, um, he does bell bonds as well. Went there and... Um, uh, networked his new camera system and then he the first thing he said to me was your boss is Mike is Mike Boone right and I said yeah and he's like you know he's a queer right and I'm like well that's my father so I know a little too well and and he just laughed wait your father's gay no he's not but oh, it doesn't mean we can't joke about it oh oh wow wow dog is an asshole apparently I mean, dog knows uh, knows dad pretty well. So, all right, it's not making die. It's not making die. What did you put in it? Five water skins. Put in five water skins, but you didn't put any berries. There's 13 berries left in there. And charcoal, plenty of charcoal and lots of wood. What berry did you put in? Red. Tento berries. Okay. Should be making dye. Give it a minute. Does it work with more than one water skin at a time? Yes, it does. Is it just not updating because I'm sitting here watching it? No, oh, because there's still ain't none. So I dropped my egg that had um, my silly putty in it. And now I don't know what to do with my life. End it. No. <laughs> no, a man's life is not complete without his silly putty. Alright, well I'm just going to let that run. It, it won't run very long. Oops. If it hasn't made any... If it hasn't... Are you sure you're using s berries that not seeds? Tinto berry. Consumable. 
definitely not a C. Alright, well, let's take that out and let's throw in a different color. Well, you should have some kind of berry, uh, some kind of dye. That's what I would think. Wait a minute, well, wait, wait, wait. Are the water skins full? Yes. It, Are it, you sure? Yes, because I just filled them all up and it ju I just got one berry of a different color almost instantly. Hmm. That actually gives me more than I thought I would get. So I probably didn't need this many. In case you haven't noticed, this is kind of turning into Minecraft for me. <laughs> well, it is Minecraft, basically, except more complex and less boring. True. The only difference is, uh, in our mod packs, typically, we have more exciting and interesting things to do. You know, I was re-watching Tech It with Duncan um, not too long ago. Which Duncan? Uh, Yogg's Castle Alna. Oh, Duncan Jones, okay. Yeah, Duncan Jones, yeah. Um, yeah, you know, I just loved his series because it was both informative and fun. Yeah, I, I, I remember, um, that. Um, you know, my favorite part of it was he used the mod pack to basically manufacture an undefusable bomb underneath his rival's house. Mm -hmm. I miss the um, old um, oh what what series was it called the uh, Jaffa Cake Factory. No, not that one. It was I think I think it was actually before that, if not Duncan's after. Duncan's Lab. No, not Duncan's oh, Lab. Oh, the original Yog Ventures series. No, that one was pretty good though. The Shadows of Israel. Oh, yeah, Shadows of Israel. You know, they said they'd pick it up one day, but some part of me just thinks, you know, I really don't think they will. Okay, Charlie, let me see what the hell you're doing wrong. I got one. And I took it out. I feel like I need to relight it the fire. Maybe that you just don't have enough Tinto Berries. Those aren't Tinto Berries. Or Amar Berries. It does take a certain amount of berries, Charlie. Well, it only ate one last time, I think, and I could be wrong. That's fine. I'll, I'll try that. Just go outside and get some more berries out of the stegosaurus. Gosh darn it, you fucking giant-ass bird. My giant-ass bird, he says, while living in a house. I wonder if I didn't have... I had only 13 Tinto berries. I think you I didn't had have 13. I mean, that would be an unusually high amount... But maybe it requires 14 to make one, or five die. I'll put 100 uh, in there, see what that does. Yeah, see what that does. It may do some. Oh, Charlie, we got something outside. What? It's a giraffe. A giraffe? Yeah, it's a giraffe, Charlie. Oh, now I'm getting one. That took 15. Yeah, t yeah see, different dies can... Oh, we also have a giant parrot outside and it's level 150 though I doubt we'll be able to fully tame it it'll probably go flying off somewhere yeah and we can't really tame this giraffe sadly well, that's no fun well the reason we can't really tame the giraffe is we have no way to trap it and that's true so it takes thing, 15 of the yellow berries as well. Yeah. Um, because it's too tall to fit through our taming pen in the... Oh. Um, yeah. Yeah, where is it? It's on the other side. Of the wall from you. There's this also wall? a... Th yeah, the wall of the house. By the way, if you're interested in a giant parrot, there was one right over here. You scared the crap out of me. Yeah, I'm not following a parrot around just to tame it. So how do we tame a giraffe? Uh, same way you tame a lot of animals. Knock it out? Yeah, you gotta knock it out. The problem is that thing's level 80. I'm pretty sure it could one-hit kill you. Me too. Yeah, to also rear pretty that sure. head back and, and gash you to death with them horns. 
Also, pretty sure I'm starving to death. Well, grab some berries since you're so uh, 